part of the new generation that's going to be taking over. Uh, when the game I mean, comes not alive. only that, but he's also using a character which a lot of people were using in the previous iteration of the game, and he's still using this character, uh, even though a lot of people think that it's not. It's just a shadow of his form. So he's still yeah. using power. Yeah. Oh, there, there he is. There it is yeah. <laughs> I'm actually surprised that through all of the DLC characters, he's still so sticking with the cloud. I mean, when, you, when you're all about the cloud hype, is there really anything else? Yeah. Yeah, that's right there. And of course, you know, you're kind of like characters like changing. Uh, Nico is actually a, character, a player that has recently just made. Um, you know, of course, he's known for his show. Being a low tier hero and then coming into the Ultimate being much longer and a much bigger play. I mean, when Cole got bumped to get the heck, I thought that he was going to be you know, committed to no matter what. Right. Yeah, exactly. But, uh, I mean, he had, he had success with the character, I'm not going to lie. But I guess there's, there's something about it, he just wants to be able to fight it up, change it up. It is not really comes down to his opinion. Boy, he's a very soldier here. He can be, like, massively aggressive. And it'll either work out in your favor or it won't. Okay. You're going to have short games. <laughs> Oh, great recovery to be able to get that right distance. I thought he was going to be one and done there, but not quite yet. Seeing a lot of empty odds coming after Spargo as he slowly approached Nico. And it made it very difficult to tell, like, okay, is he actually going to go for a tomahawk grab? But landing that back air from all these empty hops, that's going to close out of stock. Yeah. Here we go. Nico really on the hunt. Pressure. Okay, here we go. Oh, hey, neutral B. Got himself on the platform. Is he going to be able to get the chase? Yes, he's going to get that up air. And that's, Ooh, that's a, a tough position to be in when you're playing against Cloud. When Cloud is underneath the Smashville platform, his up air is almost the entire width of that platform. So it's like, do you neutral get up? You're going to get up air. Do you roll? You still make it up air. Yeah. It's not as good, but it's still a very good move. Don't get me wrong. So. Oh, try to go for the side B, and there's a lot of end lag if you don't complete it. Even if you do complete it, there's a lot of end lag. Pretty much. Uh, no good situation for Nico. Yeah, I mean, it, it does have the luxury of like being a poor input move, so that if you stop it early, there's that kind of, oh, going deep, nice, I like it, Nico. Uh, but you have that opportunity of like, okay, am I gonna keep pushing the button? Am I not gonna push the button? Ooh, it's like kind of like a 50-50. But at the same time, if your opponent has like fantastic reactions, like Spargo does, eh, it's not really a 50-50. I'm just gonna wait for you to be in lag. Yeah, and that's a great, out of, out of shield option to up smash out of shield. Mm -hmm. Very good kill potential. Uh, he's gonna have to use limit, yep. But he's, at least he's making it back to the stage. But he's back in the same position. Oh, he's able to snap to the ledge just by a single jump. And now he's back in, gonna take him out. Yeah, Spargo go for fishing that for that down air. That down air when it connects, even at mid percent, it's a huge Ooh. spike. Just like that arc, going golfing, up smash. Yep. Par four. Looks like he got a birdie on that one. Nice. Hey, here Golf we jokes. Nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but of course, no, uh, no surprise as to what's going to be coming up next. We're going to stick it out with Roy, of course. When you're a Roy main, that's all you know. Roy's <laughs> life. <laughs> I mean, he, he still has all that time with Shulk. If, nope, if he's he a Roy main now. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> What do, what do I know? I, I <laughs> asked him about this. I'm like, so, so what about Shulk? So he's like, I'm a Roy main. Like, I know what that means, man. I know the feeling. Okay, <laughs> here we go. Hey, good. Oh, I like that. He just continues what? to trap. Oh, if that was the spike, that would have been... A, uh, he's still oh, dead. He's still dead. Yeah, he's he, still he, dead. he might as well have gotten the spike at that point. <laughs> just not as clippable as it was earlier. I so. mean, I don't know. That's still pretty clippable. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, I, look, oh I looked oh, away oh, and he's got oh, to. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, to I totally looked away. I, 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 he must have gotten edge guarded or something. Up B out of shield. Got the turn around on it too. And a great parry. Going to get a big punish with that cross slash. Mm -hmm. Catching the roll with back air. And here we go. Spargo still on the hunt. This 15-year-old is merciless. And even, even though cross slash is not as good as it was back then too, it's still demoralizing to get hit by the full thing anyway. Okay, here we go. Got the chase on the platform. Three up airs, giving Cloud a taste of his own medicine. Thought he could get another sweet spot, but he's going to be minus on hit. Oh, and he catches up on the roll. Going to get that side B, close out the stock. Spargo in a good position to try and close out the set, too. Yeah, when you have that reaction time and you see your opponent roll, it is definitely time for cross ledge. You get to chop up your opponent and send him off. Ooh. Ooh. 
to go for the B reverse. I like that option. Just a little bit missed time. Nico not going to fall for it. Hey, Zagri are continuing the pressure. No. No. Not like that. Fargo said, okay, okay, I didn't get the spike the first time. Here you go, Danny. Let me give you a new one right now. <laughs> yeah, no, you got it, you got it. 